Alright, we did it. We destroyed the pack uh, resupply stations. All units fall back to the Sunrider. Let's get out of here before Pat brings in reinforcements. Pew. Okay, mission complete. Ah, uh, we have some more money. Welcome to research and development. Yeah, and I did say like, uh, let's see, I wanted to upgrade the Phoenix's evasion, but I also wanted to upgrade the shield range for the support riders. So I think did I increase shield range for the? Mm, it did, right? Or it's only hmm. it's only one shield range for the Sunrider. Did I increase shield range for the? No, I didn't. Okay, so hmm, kind of a big investment then, because one thousand each. Actually, well, this is weird. It's like I'm a little confused. Cell is five thousand. Is it cost to go up there five thousand, or is it? Why is this an X? Why? Why is this an X? I can't. I can't increase it, or it says future costs mark five twenty five thousand. What does that even mean? Mark 12, I mean, I don't know how to read that number. You know, you see in the bottom there, Mark 12? Like, that's a lot of money. I don't think that's f feasible. Uh, but, I mean, I can use this. I guess, yeah, Mark. They, the upgrades get pretty ridiculous. I guess you can't get that much money if you wanna, like, can't really fully max uh, these, uh, these statistics. Unless you have like infinite money, which I don't think is possible uh, without some sort of like uh, cheating, I guess. Let's increase. Well, okay, let's do some the simple things first. Increase that. Now shield range two. Increase shield range. To Bianca. All right. Good. Why can't I? Hmm. Uh, let's see. What's this X? I don't understand this X. What if I? What happens if I click on it? Actually, let me. Did I save already? Just in case. I don't know. Just in case it does something weird, or I just can't. It doesn't do anything at all. So let's. I'm sorry, Captain, but we don't have enough funds for that. Okay, so you can't do it. Weird. You simply can't do it. I'm sorry, Captain, but we don't have. Enough yeah, we don't have enough funds for that or something. I don't know. I guess yeah, five thousand. Is it? Is it just five thousand? No, that's just a lot of money then. Because it says price sale. I'm a little confused. It says price sale. I thought it meant like you can sell it. That's how much. You... Oh wait, no. Okay, now I get it. This is the price, and this is how much it sells for. Ah, I get it now. I'm an idiot. Okay, that's how you read it. It isn't like price sell. It's like price. Then the sell value is in brackets. That's what it means. Okay. So in order to increase shield range for the sunrise, it's like five thousand bucks. Hmm, that's a lot. I don't think that's feasible anytime soon. I guess. I mean, unless we like beat a mission, I get five thousand bucks. We can spend all our money just to increase the shield range of the sunrider. I mean, I guess it's pretty useful, and that's why it costs so much. Hmm. Well, for now, let's do what I wanted to do before. Increase the evasion of the Phoenix. Let's do that actually. 500 and 55 to 60. Ba bam! And that's all we can do. Alright, 60 evasion. That's pretty good. I don't know if that translates to like, uh, the, if it does, if it translates to like 60% evasion, or is it just like a numerical value that kind of kind of gets like uh, tested against like certain weapons. Hmm. I don't know. But either way, 60 evasion. That's pretty good. Alright. Right but now I, w I want even more money, is the thing. So, let's try to do that and do. Oh, what I. No. Save here. Okay. Uh, let's try to do another side mission if we can. Right. You can investigate lost technology, and apparently, well, 
Kato said there were maybe ghosts, ghosts or something. Or we can go here and defeat some pirates. Uh, I don't know if they mentioned like escorts. Did they mention escorts? I feel like they did, which I would. If the if, it, if this mission involves escorts, I like to like uh, avoid it like the plague is the thing because I. I want to fight an. I don't want to do an escort mission just yet until I'm fully prepared. Hmm. Report. Then again, this sounds hard though because like they. What, what did they say? Like a bunch of like battleships tried to go here as well, and they got all destroyed or something. Hmm. 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 Pirates are lost technology. Let's let's try the technology. Let's try this one. Maybe it isn't all it's cracked up to be, you know. Maybe that maybe it's just like flavor text. They're just saying it that that they're just saying that a bunch of people got lost trying to get this technology or got destroyed. But maybe it, is, it isn't so hard. The actual mission. Let's find out. All right, we'll complete. We're approaching the last known whereabouts of the Alliance squad. Keep scanning for Alliance signatures. Those ships couldn't have simply have disappeared in thin air. I'm picking up something on the scanners. Debris. Alliance made. Hmm. Looks like we found our missing squad. Warning! I'm detecting new energy signatures. P uh, pact? No. Reuvian. Hmm. Oh, red alert! More ghost ships? I've got a bad feeling about this, Captain. Perhaps we should retreat. Ah, uh, I don't know. We did fight ghost ships before, right? Reuven, like ancient Reuven, uh, riders and ships, right? It's where we found Sola, you know. I guess we have a ch we have like a option now. Hmm, it is. It does sound dangerous, right? Whatever, like destroy the entire Alliance squad. It's like. Sounds pretty powerful. This might be saying we're not strong enough to do it yet. Maybe that's what this, that's what it's saying. But then again, I'm kind of curious. Let's try it out. If it's too hard, then I just I'll just have to reload the save and try again some other time. And maybe try out the the pirate mission, you know. But yeah, those ships are guarding something, something very valuable. We're gonna find out what. Aye, right, Captain. Charging weapons. All units, attack. Yeah, if the game tells us that this will be a tough fight, I'm pretty sure, yeah. It will probably be a tough fight. So... Mm. Uh, yeah, these ships, they shoot like weird, like special types of missiles, I think they shoot. That almost always hit, I'm pretty sure. All systems are green. Uh, I want to get as close as possible. Okay. Okay, I go here. I'm here. Captain, you be here. And here. Like so, I like so. I guess yeah. This is the class formation I just I just always use. I guess. And yeah, these guys have a uh, uh, bigger shield range, so our paladin is slightly more protected compared to last time. Okay, what are what are the cap uh, what are these capabilities of these cruisers? They have they have shields. They have armor. Hmm. I'm assuming they're gonna shoot uh, missiles, right? They're gonna shoot missiles. I'm gonna want to use all guard, I assume. Let's do that. I don't need a and I guess, yeah, it's just like, let's just attack. Try to take down Definitely. the ships right in front of us. Hmm. Can't you tell me more about, about these types of ships, Sola? You're like from the time era. Right? But I guess maybe not. Maybe she maybe she she well, she said before she's more of a warrior. You know, more of like a you're a soldier, less so a uh engineer, so she doesn't really know the specifics of how these ships work or anything like that. Yeah now. Yeah, and I assume kinetic is the way to go because these are big ships. They have shields too, so like 
Laser weapons won't do much. Hmm. Alright, uh... And again, I don't know if... Hmm. I don't know if... Accuracy debuffs do anything against missiles. I'm just gonna do it in guess, just in case. Maybe I'll look that up. I don't know if anyone has ever done any kind of test like that to check if her debuffs actually affect missiles. What do you need, Captain? Hmm. Uh, let's try to finish uh, finish up this uh, ship off with uh, our little assault guns, so we can save our our uh, kinetic shot, the Paladin one of the other ships. And I guess the Phoenix can finish it off. You have slightly more evasion this time now. Uh, for the Phoenix. So hopefully she can dodge some of the missiles maybe. That's what I'm hoping. Aim up. Oh yeah, I forgot. She has aim up. Probably a good idea to use it to buff our units like so. Should have done this before, but oh well. I always forget. Like, if you have buffs you can use, you use it before you attack rather than after. Oh, she has one more shot with the kinetic, so let's do that. Well, they're, they're ghost ships, uh, Krisha. They can't really negotiate. I noticed they have zero flak too, so missiles will probably be good against them. Our own missiles, anyway. Hmm. Let's end our turn. I don't know. Well, let's see. Yeah, they shoot, like, these kind of missiles. They're pretty effective. Even with all guards, some of them still get through. Ah, that doesn't seem too bad at the moment. The Phoenix got hit a bunch from the missiles, but... It's not too bad. Hmm. I'd rather they attack the Sunrider, though. The Sunrider has a bunch of health, right? So probably be the best unit to absorb most of the attacks. Ouch. And I guess shields, well, I guess shields don't matter. Or rather, like, the energy shields, they don't, sh they, don't they don't use laser weapons. They just use missiles. Oh. Okay, they have, they do have kinetic weapons when they get close. Okay. Captain, a new unit has just joined the battle. A new unit? It's unlike anything I've ever seen before. The retreat order is available to escape from this battle? Is it that bad? Uh... Nightmare? What? Retreat. Hmm... The Nightmare. What is- what are these units? They look scary. They look very scary. Uh, and they have 100 flak. <laughs> and 100 shields. And 30 armor. And 50 evasion. Uh, I mean... Vanguard cannon? Maybe? But Vanguard cannon only does 800, right? So even if 800 damage, they have like 3200 health. What is this? This is madness. I mean, do we still get some cash if we destroy some of their ships? Maybe we should do that? I don't, I don't know. Uh, um, uh, 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 disable one of them, please. At least two of them. Only two of them will come at us, I guess. <laughs> oh. Let's destroy, one of, let's destroy one of their ships first. Let's see what they actually do. Those nightmares. Oh, 
initiate. Issue your command. Hmm. These are assault. Well, well, I didn't finish it off. Oh well. Let's go get him. Ah, you finish it off, the saga. Let's see, there's two more there. I'm here. Let's use her. I guess this might be an unwinnable battle, or at least a battle I shouldn't do at this very moment. Because yeah, the, these units just look very powerful. I mean, uh, I'm thinking melee? melee? Melee might be useful against? I don't know. Again, then again, are those like katanas? So maybe not. They just seem like good at everything. They're like big. I think I assume they have like missiles and a laser and. Hmm. If I let's like. Debuff these guys. Alright. So I gotta finish it off, or um, actually, uh, I wanna finish off the Sunrider. Or the Phoenix, actually, Phoenix. Alright, another one down. Okay, I guess that's it. Ah, uh, they have shield, so. There's not much that's all I can do. And our turn, and. Well, let's see what these nightmares do. Okay, what, 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 what is that? Ouch. Okay. Super missiles. Not the big, not the big quantum torpedoes, just like missiles that just hit a lot and also do a lot of damage. Hmm. Oh, well, only one of them hit. Is it doable? I don't know. I hate everything. <laughs> you hate everything. Can't catch me. Hmm, I'm, I'm really wondering, is it doable? I don't think you can defeat a Nightmare though. Nightmare, again, I saw it had like 50 evasion. Uh, but is it normal though? I don't know. Because the 50 evasion is pretty much like a Phoenix, right? Oh, well, she's dead. It's like 50 evasion, but also like... High armor, and just... I think they have shields too, right? Yeah. How are you supposed to fight them? Like, none of our weapons are effective against them. Not even, not even missiles, because they have high flak too. Oh, the hell are those things? They appear to be standard automated Ryuvian riders. Standard? What part of that is standard? They're in, in quite excellent condition despite their age. I speculate that they have been receiving automated maintenance, perhaps from a hidden facility on the far port moon. Seriously, how come your rider doesn't do any of that? Regrettably, the Seraphim is merely a humble scout rider, and most of its advanced systems have decayed due to millennia of non-use. Wait. So yours isn't even a real rider? Well, no. Good going, you idiot. You hurt her feelings. Hmm. I guess she, yeah, she did. She does know a little bit more about Reuven technology. I don't think we can win, though. <sighs> In fact, it's probably why we were given the retreat order. 
because we just we just can't win. It's not possible. Laser 61. They have shields though. Missiles 60. They have flak. A lot of flak. 100 flak. Uh, hmm. Now let's play it out. If we get if things get dire, then we just retreat, right? Cause I want to see, is there any 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 more dialogue? Cause we, we just got some more dialogue, that, which was interesting. Maybe we learn uh, like a weakness, you know, in a few turns, maybe, hopefully, or maybe you're just expected to beat it yourself, like 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 just normal. Hmm. I don't know. Yes, Captain. I don't know. Probably. Came up. Yeah. Well, maybe she can use. Yeah, well, I mean, she only does 300 damage, and the Awaken is only 600 damage. Probably not enough to kill a, like, nightmare. Hmm. I don't know. Let's try. In fact, it's probably uh, the, the better idea is to focus on a nightmare unit. Maybe if we destroy one of them, something happens? Let's try. Ah, uh, well. It's really not a lot of damage, though. That's only... I don't even know. What am I supposed to do? Missiles will just be deflected. What is that? 1E plus 0, 2? What does that even mean? Ah. Uh. Maybe that was a bad idea. Uh, let's just shoot this one. Let's just... I don't know. They have katanas too, so I assume they can melee. Let's shoot a missile, why not? Let's just... Let's just find out what happens if the nightmares get close. The nightmare Riders. Are they, are they called Nightmare Riders or just, are they just nightmares in general? <laughs> Uh. Okay, finish it off. Oh, well. We couldn't finish it off. How about... No, they have shoes, right? So, how about you? Saga, finish it off. You're in low health, though. I should've healed Saga, I guess. But then again, I'm kind of like... I don't know. Kind of like giving up on this run. On this mission, because I'm pretty sure it's kind of unwinnable at this very moment. That's what it feels like anyway. I wonder if we, if we retreat, can we do this mission later? You know, can we come back and do it again? Is that possible? Hmm. We can move a rider. Uh, hey, can you... No? Oops. Can you move somewhere else? Or can I... Yeah, okay. Gravity... Can you move back? You can move back, I guess. This doesn't really do much, though. Hmm. Him down? Ah. All I can do is just... Debuff. Let's see what happens. I assume they're gonna get close and use their big old katanas. Oh, at least we have a counter attack, I guess. I look for 11 damage. Oh, and you have an assault gun. If I, yeah, I can't really. I, well, actually, never mind. I was gonna say normally you can't use assault guns, but actually no, you can. I thought, I don't know, I'm just an idiot. Hey, what are you gonna do? You gonna use your big old katana? Oh, you missed! Haha! -ha! Saga's too fast for you. Oh, what are you gonna do? Okay, melee, right? No, you missed again! Uh, okay, missiles. 
Oh, dodge all of them. Saga is our MVP at the moment. Oh, but these all oh, these ships are getting closer, and therefore using they're gonna use the, their big guns. Uh, uh oh. Okay. Now what? Hmm. Reporting for duty, sir. The Sunrider awaits orders. Ah, uh, well, might as well repair Saga. And do they get? Yeah, I don't. I don't think they get counter attacks. So maybe. What I should do is do something like this and melee the shit out of him. I mean, that's okay damage. They still have a lot of health though. Let's do it again. Ah, well, you missed. Hmm, maybe the key, yeah, maybe it is to just try to melee them. In which case, the Phoenix would probably been useful at this moment, but, well, she's not here, unfortunately. Hmm, destroying these ships is probably a good idea, though. Okay. Salt guns, maybe. On target. Hmm. Maybe not. Order me, Captain. That might have stung a little. Um, we shoot again. Why not? Kind of just ignoring the uh, nightmare riders at the moment. I just like I melee them like once, and that's it. Laser? No. I can turn off their flak, I guess. Maybe. I don't. Know. And turn. Well, what's it gonna do? These counter attacks don't really do much, really. Especially since they have high health and high armor. Okay. And. Rip! Ah! That's a lot of damage. Yeah, their melee does a lot of damage, so. It's not worth it. We need to retreat, I think. And she's dead. Ah, well, ah, so I didn't dodge it this time. Hmm. <laughs> wow. Pretty much destroyed most of our units at this point. Dead. Maybe a lot of repair costs is... Oh, what? What's that? What? They have pulse weapons. And you're gonna come in, in here and finish us off? No! Come on, dodge it. Yeah! <laughs> Even though this doesn't really matter. And you're gonna shoot at us, okay? Oh, uh, I need more. Okay, missed again. Uh, before we retreat, let's just finish. I don't know. This will probably won't do anything. I was thinking maybe we get some money out of this if we destroy some of their ships, but maybe we don't. I'm actually not sure. But I was thinking let's just destroy like a ship before we go. Yay, we destroyed a few of their ships. But now we're leaving. 
Bye bye. Might, this might have been all a waste of time, to be honest. Well, we're successful, Captain. You have successfully escaped the enemy. I will need to acquire better weapons before we try that again. Okay, so yeah. We technically, yeah, we lose the mission. We don't get anything, I guess. Is it... Ah, actually, did we get some money? Maybe we did. Hmm. Maybe we can farm that place or something? I feel like we, yeah, we... I think we only had 200 bucks. Now we have 1,000. I think, unless I'm... Unless I'm, I'm forgetting how much money we had before, again. Hmm. Maybe I did, I don't know. Maybe we didn't earn anything at all. Come again soon. Well... And then again, uh, the game told us we can just try it again, right? In the future, once we get better stuff. Okay. So... What do we do? Well, there's a pirate mission. Let's, I guess, try that one. Are we gonna meet old Cosetti again? Warp complete, Captain. We are approaching the pirates. Red alert. All hands, prepare for combat. Actually, I did say that we are we have all of our units, but uh, does Cassetti join us? I was wondering about that. Because I did, I think I saw her in the main menu, right? That's why I said most of the most of the main characters are we already have. But maybe that includes Cassetti too. Hmm, I don't know. Uh, what am I doing? Uh, on this, on this, and this. And this, uh, oh, no, uh, this, and this. All right, bunch of bases. Uh, I guess these are pirate ships. So what are they? The cruisers, I think. Oh. A <laughs> new background. Uh, destroyers. So okay, destroyers. Bunch of bombers and grunts. They don't seem all that threatening, really, to be honest. So this might be an easy mission, unless, I don't know, unless Cosetti just comes out of nowhere and just destroys us. Let's uh, all guard, because I'm, I'm assuming they're going to shoot a bunch of missiles at us. And should we focus on the pirate base first? Let's see. Mm, maybe. It's probably a good idea to destroy a base first because uh, they have big shields, right? And all the other units don't have shields. So, let's destroy, or at least attempt to destroy, a base. Over here. Hmm. They do have pretty high armor, though. Hmm. If I should have, uh... Attack up. Attack up. Uh, do we need aim up, really? Actually. 100. 100. Yeah, the bases don't, they don't really, they're not gonna, they're not gonna move anywhere, so. Uh, right now, we don't need uh, aim buff. Hmm, but maybe in the future, because we might have to shoot these ships too, right? Yeah. So let's increase our accuracy. And because of their high armor, I don't think the well actually. Hmm. I was saying I was gonna say the bases probably won't go down this turn, but maybe it will. Pretty good damage, so. Why are you so sundere? Not being so sundere, assassin woman. Hmm. Okay, maybe I was trying to think, trying to finish it off with assault guns, six armor, maybe. Because again, I want to finish off. Usually, I want to finish off any kind of like hard, high, high target, uh, high, or rather, high value targets with Phoenix because she can dodge a lot of the attacks. So, 
Let's see. Maybe if I reduce more of the armor, like so. Five armor now. How many? Uh, how many damage each shot? It's about fourteen damage. Uh, maybe. Hmm. Maybe I can finish it off. One more. Sh one more assault. Yeah. Just about. Okay, good. So since she destroyed or she got the last hit for the base. Most of the units are gonna attack her, just to my to my advantage. Fifteen flak. Okay, the grunts have some flak. So I'm thinking of using some missiles. Okay, we can now attack uh, this one. This is this destroy a destroyer now. Destroy a destroyer. Uh, well, well okay, guess maybe not. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, but these grunts aren't protected by shields anymore, so let's aim at them. Easy. Can you finish them off? Maybe? Uh, maybe not, actually. Because how much armor do they have? I don't know why they have zero armor, but they were pretty far away, so that's why most of the shots missed. Uh, I think we can do it now? Okay, let's end the turn. Okay, they're gonna shoot their big ol' missiles at us now. I think it's pretty good that they're gonna, they're all gonna just shoot at the Phoenix. Phoenix has pretty high evasion, so... And the missiles only hit once. No so it's all or nothing for their quantum torpedoes. Whee! Huh, yeah, and the bases also shoot some missiles. Once. You scratched up my phoenix. You'll pay. They will pay. They will pay. With their lives. Also, I keep forgetting our crew members' names. I don't know what's her name again. Why can't I? Why can't I remember people's names in, well, in real life as well as video games? Like names in general, it's just hard for me to remember. To be honest, I mean, I remember. I think I remember most of the people, right? I know there's Kato, there's Ava, there's Asaga, Chigara, uh, Krista. Uh, Claude, Sola, right? But what's her name again? I, I don't know why I forgot. I just, I just, I don't know. Maybe in my mind I just compartmentalize, or what's the word? Compartmentalize. That's not a word. I, I guess, categorize her, or at least uh, label her as the Sundere, the Sundere assassin. So that's why I don't remember her name, because in my mind I just think of her as like the Sundere assassin. You know, uh, but uh, okay. Let's see. What do we do now? We should probably destroy the, the yeah the ships. We should take down the ships because they're probably a, a priority. So let's punch a hole in the hull. Okay.
That one's down. Because I do think, yeah, they do, like, if they get close, they do shoot kinetic cannons at us. Or I, call, I always call them cannons. I mean, I guess, yeah, they are cannons. Or kinetic guns, or cannons, something like that. They, they, they look like cannons to me. They're like, you know, cannons on like a, you know, in like a navy ship in real life. Right? I think that's two of their ships down. Alright, the rest of them still pretty far away. I wanna let them get closer and then we can uh, destroy them. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> I forgot, yeah, again, gotta buff first before I attack. Well then, let's just debuff then. Let's, uh, debuff the bases and their missiles, and probably these guys too. A bam. Alright. Uh, do we need any repairs? I mean, she got hit slightly, but she doesn't really need to repair right now. In which case... Uh, I guess... Okay, yeah, aim up. Well... I guess, yeah, might as well. So she can, like, finish off this one. Alright, and buff her. So she can shoot this one. Ooh, just barely. It's barely survived. Uh, well. I always just let the Phoenix finish off all the units in front of us. She is the tank. And, uh, again, how it works is that every time she gets the last hit, it tends to be that the enemy focuses on the ally unit that kills the... their units. So... Everyone will just focus their attacks on the phoenix which she will dodge most of them hopefully but well eventually she always she always just tends to die at the very end though or at least another not at the very end but like uh near the beginning of the mission she always just gets defeated very easily because of her low health and yeah, this one's close let's shoot lasers at this one Can we finish it off? Mm, she has kinetic. Eh, let's, well, let's finish it off instead. Alright. Hopefully there won't be any surprises. Hopefully that is a, a jinx. Okay, that's all we can do. Oh, actually no. Uh, what? Thirty percent each shot? Maybe. Maybe she can finish it off. Hmm, barely, barely not. I shoot a missile. I don't want to waste a missile, though. Let's end our turn. I want their, I want their, these two ships to get closer, so we can shoot our kinetic cannons at them. at the phoenix missing all their shots which is great because that means we take no damage as long as they keep missing we suffer no casualties which can, I really yeah I'm thinking hmm I really want to upgrade her vision even more 
is taking advantage of her, her dodging skills is quite useful, I think. But again, it really depends uh, whether or not we get unlucky. Because, because you know, like last time, she did get like one shot by a big missile. In which case, all of her evasion doesn't really help her if RNG isn't in our favor. Right. Yeah, she got hit a little bit there. Yeah, missiles being the main concern. Sometimes she dodges most of them, but sometimes they hit. Because it, al it always just seems like missiles, they have high hit chance, really. They only they only get like countered by high flak. In which case, maybe I should increase some flak then. Maybe increase her evasion as well, a little bit more flaked? Actually, what? Actually, I don't know. Which of our riders, which of our units has high flak? She has 38. She has 0. 0? 35. Hmm. And also 40. Hmm, interesting. Maybe, maybe make a saga, like, switch positions of Paladin and the saga. So saga is closer to... Her, so you, we can take advantage of her high flak, and uh, well, of course the uh, Sun Rider also has high flak too. Mm, maybe do something like that. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. In the future, anyway. Uh, well, all the ships did get close, so let's take them down. Mm-hmm. Mm, 30% and not worth it. Let's increase in t attack instead. Destroyed. And I guess, well, it's pretty, pretty easy so far. The two side missions, oh, well, I mean, uh, in, for the exception of the, the ghost one, the uh, Nightmare Riders one, the other side mission, and this one's pretty easy, you know, we don't need to think much. We just, like, stay in this position, this formation, and we pretty much won. As long as the enemies come toward us, and eat our hits. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Okay, and you will finish it off, please, and thank you. Alright, um, uh, so slow health, so you finish off that one too. Ba-bam. I guess we're just like clearing all this, all these trash, throwing out the garbage, all these weak little riders, these little pirate riders, are no match for us. All we have to worry about is just destroying the bases later. I'm gonna finish it off with her laser gun. She's not doing anything else. Oh, well, I get while well, she missed. You finish it off. And this is actually, this is actually, uh... What's the word? According to her theme, right? She's an assassin. So it actually makes sense that she's finishing off most of these, like, uh, units. Huh. I didn't really realize that until now. So maybe it is it really is like the intended way to play her. She you just use her to finish off most of the units and she draws the ire of most of the enemy here and she dodges most of them. And she's an effective like dodge tank. Hmm. That's cool. Engage. 
Now it's kind of ironic. You, you aren't like assassins. Most like they're ten, they're supposed to be stealthy, right? So you would think you're not supposed to draw attention to the assassin. She even has like a like a like a ability that's like that just says stealth. But well, there's really no real stealth mechanic. So does it really apply in this sort of gameplay? I guess it's more so that she just, you know, she just evades attacks. That's the idea. And yeah, finish off this enemy as well. Hmm. I'm actually, um, uh, well, I mean, I mean, again, this mission is pretty easy, so. Like, I was gonna say, like, I, I, I'm really valuing the uh, Phoenix's. Potential in beating missions, but at the same time, this mission is pretty easy. So probably in harder missions where enemies have just higher chance to hit, she might not be as useful, right? But we'll see. I guess it'll depend of uh, it'll, it'll depend on what upgrades I get, how useful she will be. In relation to the other units we have, let's see. Ah, I'm thinking. Let's see. These have flak. These have flak too. Let's just finish off these riders. And you know what? In fact, let's just like go up to them, like so. Time to finish them off. Then move forward and destroy them. Oh, click on her. So I want to just move a little bit forward. Uh, except you, you want to stay in here. So you can shoot, uh, why not? Shoot the space base. Shoot the space base. The spa uh, space pirate base. See. What do you need, Captain? Oh, they're protected by uh, shields, though. Hmm. Do you need something In which case, I would like to. Ah, uh, let's shut off or disable. If I shut off, there's nothing. Yeah, it's either dis disable is actually better. Ah, uh, then again, oh, actually, shields last for two turns, right? I can disable for two turns. Actually, no, never mind. Shut off is actually better. The enemy won't know what. So it lasts for two turns. I might as well, uh, I don't know, disable their flak as well. Can she do much else? No, I, don't I don't think she can. Yeah. Ooh, what I can do... Use a gravity, right? Finally a use for gravity. Like so. Or, yeah. Ta-da! Amazing. So they're out of the shields, and we can finish them off. Some variation to our strategies now, finally, but well. Only in missions where we can like take it easy. And not worry about really, really dangerous units that kill us in one turn. And you might as well shoot. Alright. And... Pulse. And pulse again. Attack. You're lucky you might live. Or not. Maybe not. In fact, I was thinking of just using two kinetic shots against the space base, but I mean we're not in, we're not in a rush, so might as well just finish you off. Or maybe not. <laughs> it was just it was just your warning shot. Now this is the real shot. 
Great. All right. Uh, this one's to save all. Ah, uh, yeah. Let's just end our turn. And yeah, oh, I f oh yeah, they use all of their missiles. I remember that the last time we fought some space bases, uh, they do have limited missiles. So I mean, we pretty much won this. Charging particles. Again, millions of innocents in this base. Well, I mean, I guess. And then again, they're pirates, right? Um, hmm, I don't know. But then again, like, I assume most of these bases are filled like engineers and doctors and just like mi miscellaneous personnel, right? Even if they're pirates, they might not be like, you know, even if they're like, uh, involved in some way, they might not be, uh, like, directly involved in the pirating business. So whether or not they're culpable is like debatable. But well, I guess we're just we're not gonna show any mercy. Uh. The Sun Rider awaits orders. Hmm, actually it's probably let, let's see. We can probably just shut shut their shoots off. It's probably easier to just shoot lasers. Yeah, lasers just just overall will do more damage because they just hit more often, really. You did it. Uh, let's see how much armor they have. Five armor. In fact, let's just just finish it off. It's a massacre. It really is a saga. You're li it's you're. Murdering them all. Dead. Ah, uh, you. Well, you don't have any laser weapons, so you you just use your kinetic guns. As it turns out, they can't really do much. I mean, at this point, if this was like. Not during gameplay, they would like maybe surrender. I mean, I, I assume they would rather go just go to prison instead of die, but it's not really possible. So here's some missiles. All right, almost, and finish it off. Sundari assassin. Do what you do best and kill millions of potentially innocent pirates, but maybe not. I don't know. The morality here is kind of gray. But we did it. And I got a bunch of cash. And that's what we really did it for. For the money. <laughs> uh, 2,000. And some command points too. Alright. All pirates have been neutralized. Good job, everyone. Retrieve our riders. One more thing, Captain. During the battle, we discovered a group of former Sarah Space Force sailors working with the pirates. Yeah. You know, sometimes the pirates are kind of recruited against their will as well, too, you know? Hmm. They're, mostly li they're most likely deserters who signed up with the local pirates after our government was dissolved. They surrendered during the battle and now offering to join our ranks. Okay, well, yeah, I guess some of them can surrender. I don't know. Again, during gameplay, they just explode. I don't know if any of them escape or uh, surrender. Well, I guess we'll just have to imagine that. What should we do with them? Hmm? Well, bring them aboard. I mean, I mean, I guess we can also just murder them. But I mean, when you think about it, did they did they have any choice? I don't think they did. Their home planet was destroyed, or at least their home like main capital was destroyed and overtaken. What are you gonna do? In order to survive, you gotta do what you can. So, 
But now they're, they're trying to atone for their sins, I think, so we could use some more hands. Bring them aboard and give them their old uniforms back. We need all the people we can get. Disappointing. I'd rather not share a ship with this band of cutthroats. They're just sailors, Ava. What were they supposed to do after our whole government collapsed overnight? Ah, very well, Captain. I suppose our waste management team could use some more help. <laughs> I guess they're gonna scrub the toilets. Oh well.